CBS News, Los Angeles. Time now, 457 coming up, cracked beams and now a three-phase fix for the Transbay Terminal. And because of that fix, Fremont Street is still closed off to traffic this morning. We'll bring you details on the fixture. Play False Fortune Slot Tournaments to win your share of up to 120,000 in prizes. Thursdays all month long. We're giving away up to 10,000 in cash with up to 30,000 in total prizes at each tournament. False Fortune, only at Great and Resorting Casino. Honey, what's the deal with Prop 10? Oh, you mean the anti-homeowner initiative? Wait, 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 anti-homeowner? Says it right there. Prop 10 takes away existing rights for California homeowners. An unelected board could set the price on the room rent in your own house. What? That's crazy. Look, independent researchers say Prop 10 will make housing more expensive and harder for people to find. It seems like Prop 10 makes a bad problem worse. Exactly. Vote no on 10. Play False Fortune slot tournaments to win your share of up to 120,000 in prizes. Thursdays all month long. We're giving away up to 10,000 in cash with up to 30,000 in total prizes at each tournament. False Fortune, only at Great and Resorting Casino. CH Premier Jewelers introduces Omega Tresor. Discover this exquisite collection made especially for women. Defined by classically thin case, and modern touches of elegance. Encased with a special mirrored case back with her time. Visit us at CH Premier, Westfield Valley Fair, and Stanford Shopping Center. The California Medical Association, representing over 43,000 doctors, strongly opposes Prop 8 because it will cause dialysis clinics to cut back services or shut down. The American Nurses Association California opposes Prop 8 because it hurts patients. Emergency room physicians oppose Prop 8. It'll force vulnerable dialysis patients into already overcrowded emergency rooms. Please join medical professionals and experts in voting no on Proposition 8. Live from the CBS Bay Area studios, this is KPIX 5 News. It is being called the biggest day ever for police accountability. The two landmark bills just signed into law by Governor Brown. And all hands on deck at the Transbay Terminal to fix the problems underway this morning. And it is Fleet Week in San Francisco, how the Navy is gearing up to put on a big show. Good morning. It is Monday, October 1st. Thanks for waking up with us. I'm Kenny Choi. And I'm Melissa Kane. All right, let's take a peek outside. Hello, Jacqueline, uh, in just a bit. But first, a live look at some of the traffic. 580, 680 interchange in Dublin. Jacqueline, of course, will tell you all about that. Uh, problems uh, across the bay for your morning commute. And a live look at the Bay Bridge this morning. Clear conditions, but we certainly are going to get some rain. Traffic coming up in just a second, but first it's Mary Lee. You know, it's so nice to actually see our live cameras yeah, out there, beautiful. right? Carl DeFog not in the bay this morning. And as we head through the afternoon, we're looking at partly to mostly cloudy skies, but we are tracking the rain that will be in the forecast for us, especially for tonight and into tomorrow. That'll be great to see that widespread rain. It's been a long time for us. A live look with our suture cam looking east and uh, beautiful there. You can see the bay, downtown lights. Temperatures are on the mild side from 63 in Concord, Oakland, 59 in Livermore, 60 in San Francisco, 58 in San Jose, and 56 for Santa Rosa. So your weather headlines.